Welcome to a cold episode of It's Time to Go. I don't know about you, but I am freezing. It uh, is very cold. Yeah, but we are here at the Vinji Cemetery uh, because this week we come to the end of David's life and he's doing a little reflecting about what he wants to pass on as he passes on. And so uh, we're here at the Vinji Cemetery thinking about all the people who would pass on the faith to us and how we might pass on that faith to others. Uh, reading starts with this great line where David uh, calls his son Solomon to him and says, I am about to go the way of all people, um, rather than just saying, I'm about to die. That's what he says. And it's more than just good writing. It's a reminder that all of us uh, will die. Uh, not even being king is enough to prevent that from happening. And in my own life, I reflect on some people who seem kind of larger than life, some really famous, just good quality people. Uh, and when they die, it's almost kind of surprising, like, oh, they were mortal too. Uh, Nelson Mandela comes to mind as an example of just one of those people. Oh, he was mortal too. Um, so as David's passing things on to Solomon, he's giving him instructions about what it means to be a good king and what he's going to need to do um, once his dad is gone. And one of the, the main things that's written down here is that David is very concerned that Solomon will be a faithful person. Uh, that he will continue in the way of David and his ancestors and be faithful to God. And God will in turn, of course, continue to be faithful uh, to Solomon and to David's kingdom. Yeah, this week, uh, as we get ready for Thanksgiving, we can not only stuff our faces with good food, but uh, we can think about all the things we're thankful for, the people we're thankful for who have passed on the faith to us. And this week, we want to make sure to say a big thank you to all of you. Uh, you do a wonderful job of passing on your faith to us and to the future generations of our church. We're here in this Benji Cemetery remembering all the wonderful, faithful people who have passed on the faith to you and to many others. And we encourage you this week to think about those people you are thankful for, uh, to give thanks to God for them, and to continue sharing the good news of what God has done for all of us. That sounds great, and it sounds like it's definitely time to go because it continues to be cold. I'm freezing my butt off. Have a good week. Bye.